warmly welcome everybody here today. We've uh, worked jointly with the guys at the Team Virtual Worlds to create this fantastic roadshow event for you today. The principle behind today's event is really about compel uh, creating a compelling show experience for all of you. So we've got some uh, great content, will inspire you, but most importantly, will ultimately help you create a great experience for your customers. We specialize in designing um, and creating compelling brand experiences for people. Um, specifically, generally in the world of retail. We also uh, designed this place, by the way, the Water Studio, um, and it's been really nice to maintain a relationship with our, our clients at, at, at Hansgrow and to be asked today to come along and to supplement the amazing stuff that you're all going to see today from Virtual Worlds. We are still human beings and will always be human beings. And the thing that guides all of the things that we think about when we design experiences is coming back to those human factors, understanding psychology, understanding human nature and going, okay, how do we marshal all these things that we could do around an experience that we should create for them to create those uh, connections? We're really pleased to be um, hosting Virtual Worlds here. It's a key tool that our clients used um, along the way with the consumer experience so consumers can really see what their future bathroom will really look like. We're all about the retailers and we're interested in the problems that you face. That then sets us about with our thought process to how can we solve these problems. So what we're going to do now is we're going to get into Virtual 4D Theatre and you can all experience it for yourselves. Imagine Caroline is our customer. She has already talked through um, the design, like Nathan says. She'll have picked out products and she's coming back for her consultation. So this is going to be the first time you see your new design. So this is your new bathroom that we're going to present to you. Are you excited? Yes. Good. With my role in the business, I actually see virtual worlds being used all over the country. It's, um, it's taken the consumer perception of all bathroom products, all the brands that are on it, including Hans Grow and Axor, to a different level that consumers can really envisage it, can make amendments, can change. The businesses that use virtual worlds can work much more efficiently um, and deliver a consumer experience in a manner that's efficient to their business. There's a lot of customers that can't visualise um, and this just brings it all in for them really, puts it together, get their head around the products that they've, put, you know, they've chosen and how it's actually going to look because uh, it can be very different in their minds of how it's going to look so it, it completes it for them I think. We've got um, four or five licenses at the moment um, so yes we use it daily with our customers and uh, yeah, designs etc. Even though we've been using virtual worlds for a few years now, there's a lot that we've picked up on um, that we can implement, which we don't currently do. Forty Theatre is a great way for consumers to uh, really bring to life the beauty of water, which is what Hands Grow is about. And it's a great way to really get over some of the many barriers that consumers have around um, picking products, particularly uh, some of us ours. This levels of the technology really take the consumer experience to another level. The way that they can interact with this and fully visualise and really, for the first time ever, probably fully understand these products, these beautiful products from Hands Grow and Axel that they're going to have in their home along with all the other products. We find that Virtual Worlds helps um, the end users get a full overview of the bathroom design, uh, helps them see all the experience including the way the waters flow uh, within the shower, uh, which is a real helpful tool for, uh, for the showrooms and for the end users. I was using the 3D part of it before and that worked really well, but I think doing 4D is on a completely different level. Um, as I say, it's literally stepping into their actual bathroom, so it is completely different, definitely. No better way of sort of demonstrating to the customers exactly what their bathrooms are going to look like or can look like, changing designs, changing tiles, changing finishes, giving them that um, sort of real feel for what their bathrooms will look like without them actually having to purchase a single item, testing before they actually get installation. Yeah.